Custom GTP here and let's talk video cards. Okay, quick and easy. Uh, we're talking about my Project Xeon. Beautiful P PC that I built with my 1660 version 2, uh, 3.7 with a 4.0 max turbo, 6 core, 12 thread Intel chip, uh, 780 Ti. Um, I think I have this thing nicely overclocked. I'll show uh, my overclocking on the afterburner uh, after I get done talking about this real quick. But um, why I chose it. Um, I wanted to water cool something and I didn't want to break the bank. I already own the TI, 1080 Ti. I already own the 1080 Hybrid in my movie room build and my son has 1060. I really didn't feel like I needed to purchase another five hundred dollar seven eight hundred dollars now a video card and even the 1070 which would have been a good idea to water cool still would have been a bad idea for me for a computer that i built for visuals and slight performance but i have my zombie hunter build my movie room build and my son has a computer and we really don't have room for other computers i built this for pure uh learning uh and art and I'm addicted. So, yes, I am. I'm addicted to building computers. That's why I do a lot of this. This computer will probably sadly be sitting downstairs on display and not really being used. But with that said, I paid $170 for it and I paid, I think, about $50 for the water block. Uh, it was a used block that someone was selling on Amazon. It was packaged up and everything like it was brand new. You wouldn't even realize it was used. I question if it was even used. So basically with that said, water cooled graphics card for a little over $200. Can't beat that. Now here's some gameplay that I'm going to show you at 1080p. Mostly all the games going 60 frames per second. All the settings on most of the games are all pretty much as high as they can go.
Thank you.